In today's video, we have a cat breed that can be compared to a mime, in terms of being silent. The Chartreux Cat Breed As with so many breeds, it's not really known how the cats came by their name or how or where they were developed. One of the earliest references to a French grey cat dates to 1538, an epitaph for Balade, who belonged to the poet named, Joaquin de Belay. Joaquin describes Balade as death to rats, which is certainly an attribute of the breed. The first reference to the name Chartreux for the blue cats is found in the Universal Dictionary of Commerce, Natural History and the Arts and Trade of Savary of Bruges, published in 1723, which also mentions the cat's association with the fur trade. French naturalist George Louis Leclerc, Comte de Buffon, described them as the cat of France and gave them the Latin name Felis Catus Cuarulius, which translates to blue cat. It was fortunate that fanciers had begun to breed the Chartreux when they did, because after World War II, none of the free-roaming cats could be found. Chartreux, which are still uncommon, were first imported into the United States in 1970 and were recognized by the Cat Fanciers Association in 1987. Today the cats are recognized by all major American cat associations. The Chartreux is even the official mascot of the Montreux Jazz Festival. They are less known in Europe, even in their homeland of France. Unlike many cat breeds, they have changed little over the years and remain, as Belay wrote. The most handsome perhaps, that nature ever made in cat's clothing. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. The Chartreux has the sturdy, powerful body of a working cat wrapped in a short, thick, water repellent coat. Besides his beautiful fur, his most distinctive feature is his deep orange eyes, set in a rounded, broad head. He has full cheeks and a sweet, smiling expression. Medium-sized ears sit high on the head. His body type is sometimes described as primitive, being husky and robust with broad shoulders and a deep chest. His relatively short and fine-boned legs rest on round, medium-sized paws that look almost dainty. A lively, flexible tail is heavy at the base, tapering to an oval tip. Don't let his ample body and solid muscle mass fool you. This is a supple, agile cat who typically weighs 7 to 16 pounds at maturity. Pick him up and you may be surprised by his heft. Chartreux grow slowly and males especially may not reach their full size until they are 4 or 5 years old. The medium short double coat has a slightly woolly texture, which varies depending on the cat's age and gender, as well as the climate in which he lives. For instance, mature males have the heaviest coats, while females or young cats may have a thinner coat or one that feels silky. The coat can be any shade of blue-gray. The tips of the fur look as if they have been lightly brushed with silver. Kittens may have the faint imprint of tabby markings, called ghost barring, or tail rings, but by the time they mature the coat should have a bright, even tone. Completing the look is slate gray nose leather, blue lips, and rose toe paw pads. The tolerant and gentle Chartreux fits nicely in a home with children. He is more likely to walk away, than to scratch if he doesn't like the way he is being handled. Parents with young children should always supervise interactions, to make sure the cat isn't mistreated. He is happy to live with cat-friendly dogs, thanks to his amiable disposition. It is ideal to introduce pets slowly, and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button as it greatly helps out the channel. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on for more videos like this. Thank you for watching.